All right, guys, Rock here. A uh, bunch of people asked me how I did the all-in-one sequence sh shots for uh, a couple of ones I posted on the forum. So I figured I'd do a quick little tutorial. It's super easy. Shouldn't take you guys too long. Start off, obviously, you got to take the photos. You do them in-game. Um, anywhere between, like, six and eight shots would be more than enough. The more pictures you take, the more detail you're going to get in the trick, but the tougher it's going to be and the more cramped your photo is going to be. I shot this particular one at 10 millimeter. Um, 10 millimeter using the glitch seems to work the best because you can get the full trick in the sequence without having to move the camera too much. Because if you move the camera, you're going to have to screw around trying to line up backgrounds and it just becomes a bear. If you just use the straight free cam and leave it where it is, you should be all right. So here I have the first picture open. Um, what I'm going to do is go ahead and add a layer. You go here, go layer, new layer. Just hit OK. You know, see it pop up down here. And then I utilize bridge. If you have bridge, use it. If not, you're just going to open the next picture in the sequence. And it'll come up as another tab up here. What you're going to do is click on the picture once. Come up here to select. Hit select all. You can also use control A, whichever works for you. And then you're going to copy that picture. And control C works just as well. And then go back to your original picture. Make sure that your the layer you just added is selected. And then what you're going to come in here, paste that picture right onto that layer. Now you notice that your guy in the first from the first picture disappeared. So what you do now is make sure you have your rectangular select tool selected. And you're going to just draw a box around the guy on this layer. Now one thing to remember, if you're doing any of these photos where they have shadows, you're going to make sure you want to grab enough to get the shadow as well. Otherwise it's going to look weird because your shadow is just going to disappear. It's going to look fucking stupid. Once you do that, come up here to layer and you're going to go down to layer mask and reveal selection. And what that does is it makes sure that only that your guy shows up in that top layer. And then same thing, you start over, add another layer, okay, and then flip back to bridge, open the sh third shot, same thing, select all, copy, I'm going to use shortcuts on this one, and then sit on that layer, draw your box, the layer, layer mask, reveal selection, guy shows up. Now you notice since you used a square and this guy's arm ends up coming up underneath the third picture, you can see his arm gets cut off. Super easy solution for this. Come over here, grab your eraser tool. Up here you can select the proper size. Nine should be more than enough. And you just erase that part of the third layer so that his arm shows back up. Some of these can get pretty detailed depending on how many shots you took, how close together the guys are. You can always zoom in using your zoom features here to get nice detail and you can go all the way down to one pixel on the eraser. So just do what you gotta do. Other than that, just keep repeating that process over and over again until you got all your shots in there. And then save as a JPEG, upload it and show it off to everybody. Alright guys, enjoy it. Peace.